In July 2018, I had an ultrasound. Rebecca had abnormalities. The chain of command said, whatever you need, we'll support you. The medical staff, they taught me what services I had available to me. So they'll help provide uh, financial support for the travel, uh, accommodations if it's needed. Meals are also provided. Being uh, a single mom, my boys had to grow up really quickly. Time, um, they've been really active thanks to this, um, uh, the opportunities the Canadian Forces brings for the families and through MFRC. I have a very understanding chain of command that we all have families at the end of the day that are behind us and support us. To be a commanding officer of, of any ship is an honour. Other women joining the forces now see that this is something that, that is absolutely in their realm of possibility to do. I could focus entirely on what the ship needed to do and, and its goals and moving things forward without having to worry about whether or not the bills were being paid, you know, the kids were doing their homework or any of that. The military did everything they could to support us through this process. Canadian Forces uh, policies right now recognize that it's people first. So it's not only people in uniform, but it's also the families be behind them.